Leading broadsheets the Inquirer and Star wore their hearts on their sleeves last week. They published special supplements for hotshot CEO Manny V. Pangilinan, or MVP, who turned 67 on July 14. In its 12-page supplement, Inquirer lavished praise on MVP and extolled him as the most valuable Pinoy. They called him a conqueror because MVP's idol is Alexander the Great. Meanwhile, the star paid a gushing homage to the man who they say is shaping a smarter future, all this in a 20-page supplement. This attention to MVP is unrivaled. Not even President Aquino gets that kind of treatment. Well, MVP is part owner of both newspapers and plans to acquire controlling shares in the star. His companies are also among the biggest advertisers in the country. We're getting the wrong signal here. Will MVP, with all his business interests, still be the subject of fair scrutiny in these newspapers? And the bigger question is, how will the Inquirer and Star balance the interests of a major shareholder with that of the public? This is Marites Vitug for Vitug Vlogs.